Look at the freaking bar. Holy jeez. Oh, they're getting <laughs> it's vomiting all over the place. <laughs> <laughs> Hello everybody, Grace still plays and I'm here with a new game for the channel called Tavern Tycoon. No time for BS. I wanted to check this out. So this is a tavern simulator owning simulator. Basically, instead of being the adventurer who goes out in search of glory and gold, we are the guy that they come home to after they took an arrow to the knee. Yes, we run, I don't know, Grace Hall of Merrymaking here. It's called the Dragon's Hangover, I do believe, and our job is to become the host with the most that every adventurer loves to come home to after slaying monsters and rescuing maidens? I don't know. This is the beginning of our tavern, man! Over here, it looks like we haven't cleaned things up in a couple hundred years. Uh, I hope that that's just grass and not sludge. So let's begin with, let's build a bar first. You can build furniture through the furniture panel. Alright, yeah, let's get it started. Uh, oh, there's a couple things here. We got tables, bars, reception desk, huh? Bench, staff, podium, fireplace. Ooh, everyone needs a fireplace. Oh, potted plant. And a piano and a performing stage. Sure. Let's do the bar. Purchase the item. So it takes a little bit of our funds to do so. And then place it. Right click to rotate. Uh, okay. So where would you want a bar? So you're walking in the tavern. And what do you do? Well, let's see, the bar should be kind of close, shouldn't it? You wouldn't want it all the way in the back here. That seems like a bad idea, keeping everyone walking too far away. Maybe if we put it like, um, hmm. So, like, music over here, bar over here. Actually, you know what? I want the bar somewhere over here. Now, what happens if I put it on this, on this kind of area? Will it, like, clip through the wall? All right, it says now hire a bartender for it. I wonder if I can move this later. Let's find out here. So, staff. Oh, my God, they have names. C. Fitzherbert. The wage is 73 copper or gold. While all my fellows are venturing out in seek of fortune and glory, I decided to be more practical with my life. It might be a hard job, but I'll learn many skills with this job. I might not know anything now, but it's better than hunting monsters. All right. Well, thank you, C. Fitzherbert. Who else do we have here? Oh, there's more than one. Can you hire different people? Oh, here we have A. Ryal. I'm an aspiring writer. Of the epic nature, however, I lack experience in adventures of far lands and the dangers of horrible creatures. I figured the best way for me to find inspiration at home would be to work at a tavern bar. With all the recent hype in hero activity, surely, and the taverns must be filled with the chatters of great adventures. Two birds with one stone. The coin would help me save up for a new writing kit. Okay. Well, whatever your name is. Oh, he's floating around. He is dancing. He's dancing, baby. Well, we can make him dance all over the place. Place the bartender anywhere with the left mouse button. He should be able to find his way to the bar. Okay, let's put you over here. Oop, there he goes. All right, buddy. You know what to do, right? Excellent. Click on the zone panel to build a kitchen. All right. Uh, what do we got here? Kitchen for 900 gold. Oh, wow. 34,000 gold. Man, I'm swimming in it over here. Drag your mouse over an area to build a kitchen. Click proceed when the tiles are blue. Uh, all right. I mean, does it have to be connected? Well, I guess it would have to. How about this corner kind of over here? How does this work? Oh, how big does your kitchen have to be? Right, right about this big, I guess. Click proceed. All right. Ah, proceed. Bam. Oh, wow. Okay. It, like, legitimately walls this area in. That's interesting. Place a door. Uh, sure. I'll put a door over here. Place the prep table and stockpile inside the room with the left mouse button. Okay. Figured out how to turn everything. You gotta right click first. Got it. Uh, okay, so let's put this, I guess, toward the back right here. There we have it. Place the prep table and the stockpile, huh? There's the stockpile. Where can I, sh where can I shove this? How about right over here? No. How about if I turn it? Right about here should be good. There we go. Click proceed to finish building. Give me my kitchen. Well done. That's how you build rooms. Okay. That's good to know. This is where this little tutorial session ends. So figure out the rest of the stuff. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. By the way, I'd build a couple of tables and hire maidens to serve food. Good luck. Well, thanks for the tutorial. Wow, this place looks like crap. Is that a pig or a rat? What is this? Look at the size of this creature. We have a litter problem. Perhaps you should hire a handyman to resolve this. Yeah, holy crap. Um, okay, handyman it is. Let's go ahead and get one going here. Jeez. Competing tavern. Den of Dens has opened in the area. Well, it's not going to beat 
The dragon's hangover. You must not know, baby. All right. Let's freaking do this. Over here to staff. Grab ourselves a handyman. We got T-Day. C-Hide. A. Centijon. How come some of the wages are different? Oh, it must be their skill levels. Let's take the best guy. I've always been really good with my hands. Tinkering and fixing old broken things. I figure I might as well get paid for what I'm good at. Though I have no official training on the job, I'm keen to pick up anything to improve my skills. Great, this guy has no experience, whatever. There, right on top of the crap, right on top of the crap pile. Start sweeping her up, baby. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. So, our bar's a little bit jacked up. Choose a tavern name. I thought, I thought we had a tavern name. Do I get to name it something else? Oh, there's a sign over here. There's nothing on it. Mail? You've got mail? What is this? Are you ready to get my people drunk? Hello there. In case you're not aware, I'm your local lord. Oh, God. Oh, no. People are starting to pour in. We don't even have seating areas. I'm writing this letter to let you know that I'm keeping the eyes on your newly established dripping place. The thing is, my people deserve a good cup of mead after your... A hard day's labor, and this is where you and your tavern fits in. I made arrangements to aid you if you ever need me. A loan of reasonable interest rate. Nevertheless, I wish you the best and hope your your business thrives. Keep it cool. What kind of lord says keep it cool? January 29th. I think that's, uh, it is not January 29th right now. Oh, God. Okay. Um, uh, furniture. Let's see here. We need tables. Uh, yeah, let's do, like, four of these right away. Uh, boom. Okay, purchase. All right, so table number. We're gonna make the dining area kind of over on, where do I want it at? We're gonna start over on this section. So one, two, and then right over here. Hold on, hold on now, three, blam, four. Okay, good. Now we need, what does manage do? Oh, you get, what is this? This must be the happiness. This guy's slightly happy. Look at his frowns turning upside down, baby. 63, give him a bonus, give him a raise or fire him. <laughs> Get out of my tavern! Back over to the staff area. We need maidens. Uh, maiden. What do we got? R. Martin. Martine? N. Seville. Ooh, potential. B+. Plus. C. Let's get, let's get the B- minus girl. No one sees the importance of having a clean room to sleep in. I was a home decorator for nobles before they all set out for war and glory. I can promise you. Not only to clean rooms, but a home for your customers. They will feel at home with the way I do things. I won't ask for a lot of pay. I just need a job. All right, M. Moore, or whatever your name is, get to work. Start helping these people out. We need to make money. Alrighty, we got someone drinking over here at the bar. Looking pretty good. The very first thing I want to do, though, is get my bar jacked up. I want a bigger bar. Hold on here. How does this work? A reception desk. Okay. Let's, um, let's start with the bar. I want at least two more bar tops. There. Yes, yes, let's see, how do I, all right there, yeah, that's it, baby. Our bar's gonna go this way now, I've decreed it, excellent. Okay, so now we're probably gonna need at least two more bartenders for this. I may be going too big, too heavy, too fast. Uh, C grade, I want the best potential, bunch of C's in here, look at all these schmucks. There's no one here of any value. Wage of seven, wow, uh, let's do... A plus! Where, where was this guy at my whole life? Holy cow, get in there! Get in there, buddy! You're the man I've been looking for! You're the man this tavern needs! That's what I'm talking about! Uh, we need at least one more bartender. Let's see here. Yeah, Hall, Bennett. C plus isn't bad. Uh, do we have anyone else? Nope, that's it. Looks like C plus is the best we're gonna get. Alright, C plus it is for G Coffin! That sounds very, very, uh... I don't know, it sounds kind of sad. What happened? Oh, he's tipsy! He's stumbling, he's stumbling around over here! Build a staff room for tired staff members to rest in. I don't like that my that my walls didn't touch over here. I wish I could have done this a little bit better. Can I do something with this? Is this is this like where we're gonna have our staff break area? Build a restroom if you don't want guests making a mess on the floor. Oh god. Alright, um, a restroom, huh? Let's build that kind of in this corner over here. Let's do that right away, as a matter of fact. All right, so zone, restroom. Build a nice restroom here. We're going to jack this restroom up big time. Here we go. Oh, yeah. 
like that right there proceed okay see that's what i wanted there we go we're gonna put a door right here on this side excellent okay sweet that's a hell of a restroom uh oh you have to put a toilet in all right uh which way is which way is this face so it faces like this huh all right put uh one right there little toilet booth there and it looks like we got a hand washing basin. We'll put the hand washing basin. Um, let's see here. Where would this normally be? Like right about now, that because then you're looking at the damn toilet when you're when you're doing your thing over here. Let's put the hand wash basin right over here. There we go. We're set. Got a toilet. Got a hand wash basin. Proceed. Bam. Restroom it is. Already there's fecal material all over the ground. Yes. Pay your bartender. Okay, the staff room. We need the staff room. We're going to want that probably over here by the kitchen area. In fact, this whole rear area, what I'm going to do is probably have bars all the way across. And this is going to be like a big staff area. So let's do that. Total wage was 763. Wow, the months are really flying by. Okay. Um, zone. This is a quick paced game. I actually kind of like it. Staff room. Staff room is a resting place. Who sit in couches, recover stamina. Do not require maintenance. Okay, good. Let's do this. All right, put it right along with this right here. I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna make it pretty big because I eventually want a decent amount of staff. Okay, right there. Proceed. Excellent. Okay, good. We're gonna put a door right over. Oh, well, you know what? This way they can't see into the staff room. Let's. Uh. Well, I don't know if I put something over here. That's gonna get all jacked up. Screw it. We're putting this here. Okay, a nice couch right toward the back right there. A lovely carpet over here for some interior decorating. And what the hell? A cabinet. Uh, but I want the cabinet over here. There we go. Proceed. Nice. Yes. Fantastic. We're going to need more maidens. That is for darn sure. Uh, let's get a maiden that's not fantastic. We're going to get we're going to get someone. Wow, an A+ plus maiden. Okay. Well, never mind. We're getting the A+ plus maiden. I was supposed to be the cook and quarter maids for the local navy. But after my first trip, I quickly realized that I'm afraid of the seas. Cooking and cleaning is what I'm trained for. But I do expect fair pay. As for foul language in the taverns, please, I used to work with sailors. I'm going to tell you, listen, this is pretty funny. Like, the little things that the people say are pretty damn cool. Is this guy being helped over here? He's waiting for a maiden to take his order. All right, let's get... We got four tables. Do we really need four maidens? I don't think we do. There we go. She's taking the order. Yes, order the food. Do we need a cook? Hold on. Let's see what other kind of staff we can hire. Because do the maidens cook as well? Over here to staff. What else can we have? A clerk. Clerks station the reception desk and allow tired guests to check in and out of guest rooms. Guest rooms? I want that. We want guest rooms big time. Are we actually making any money? I see our money is going down here. I can tell you that right now. Uh, we're probably going to need more tables. If I could tell you one thing, that's probably it. Oh, there's a ton of mail coming in here. Thinking about visiting. Oh, God. Oh, look at all these reports. Uh, all right, let's look at the reports. Visitors, three. 120, 170 gold expenditure and staff wage. Wow, we are, like, way under where we need to be. Uh, I mean, we're going up slowly, but it is not quick enough at all. Okay. So we need to get rooms, like, now. Uh, what do we got here? Guest rooms. Okay, I think this is going to be our guest room area, I would assume. So, how big are you allowed to make your guest room? Let's take a look here. Oh, do I have to make it down here? Oh, I can't even use this yet. We, can, we haven't even opened this yet. Okay. So, guest rooms, huh? Where do I want to put these? I guess we're putting the guest rooms over here. How big are your guest rooms? Let's find out. How big do you have to make them? Oh, bigger than that. Um, all right, get rid of that. Hold on. There we go. Four by three. Uh, sure. Right there. Put a door. We're going to have a little bit of a hallway right here. Put a door over here. Uh, you, sir, get a bed. We're going to put your bed over here so that I can actually see it facing the door. Lovely carpet as well. There's your wardrobe. Oh, where can I put this wardrobe? Can I put it over here? No. Can I put it over here? There we go. Wardrobe over here. Proceed. Excellent. Okay, good. So now we have a place for people to go when they're tired. Uh, but we're going to need a reception area. Do furniture. Let's see here. Reception desk. 
one of these. I'm gonna purchase this. The reception desk is gonna be... Where do I want the reception desk at? Let's see. I think I'd like to make it... Do you want it, like, right when you come in? You know what I mean? Like, it's like the first thing they see so they can talk to this guy and if they don't want to. You know, it's like how you get greeted over at Outback or whatever. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Reception desk. Right there. Staff members. Oh, this is gonna be the most jacked up freaking tavern ever made. Uh, the clerk. Okay, who's our best clerk here? We got C's all around. C's all around. Alright. Uh, hold on. That guy's name's S. Gray! This is what I'm talking about. S. Gray, you're the man! Get over there. Or woman? Is that a woman? I don't know. Station at the reception desk. They're very happy. Good. 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 Let's check our mail over here. Group reservation, huh? I would like to make a group reservation for eight locals. I would like that. Yes, a group reservation uh, for seven locals. Yep, Lord Peter, you're getting one as well. I'm thinking about, okay, taverns bustling. I've got super curious man visit. Yep, feel free to come on in, baby. Get on in here. We're going to need more people cleaning this place up. We're going to need more people cleaning this place up big time. We need another handyman. Oh, boy. Oh, can we survive? Can our tavern survive? We have a bunch of C pluses. This is terrible. L clear. Congratulations, you're a handyman now. Hope you enjoy. Okay, we got one person over here renting a room. Looking good. Wow, people are really starting to file in now. Holy crap. Uh, another guest room. Let's get one built. Come on, baby. Build me that guest room. Build it tall and proud. Okay, one of these. Excellent. Again, another door uh, right over here like so. I want to keep things kind of looking pretty similar. Oh, Jesus, I put the headboard the wrong way. Oh, Gray, what have you done, you poor bastard? All right, whatever. I'm, I'm getting the hang of this. You guys know how it is. It takes a little bit. Oh, can I cancel? Oh, I can cancel it. Yes, I can fix it. But now they're not all going to be the same direction. Oh, whatever. You guys will forgive me, right? <laughs> oh, who makes the greatest taverns in all the lands? It sure isn't me. Okay, so the headboard needs to face the wall. There we go. This goes over here. Put this down on this end. Bam, now we can proceed. I wonder if we can ever fix this or like take it down or anything. Yes, yes, we've got two rooms now being fulfilled. Excellent. Food is getting served. Holy crap, people love the bar area. Man alive, what is this person doing? What are you doing? You're just, you're just standing there. What are you? Who are you? Did you just vomit all over the ground or something? Or you're waiting? Like you're waiting for what? Are you waiting for a seat? Oh, I'll bet you are. Holy crap. All right, more bars. More bars. Uh, more furniture. Oh, look at this. A fireplace. Provides heat and comfort for nearby guests. A standing clock. Shows the time. Potted plant. Piano. Piano free musicians. A performing stage. Oh, wow! I want a performing stage! Hold on. Let's see here. Can we get this? Is someone vomiting or yawning? I think they're just yawning. Okay. Where can I put this? I, wanna, I don't want to put it over there. We're going to put this over here. Performing stage. Look at this, though. It looks like it has an aura. Um. Can we put this... Oh, this is tough. Maybe... Maybe we'll put the performing stage back over here by where all the by where all the people sit. I don't know. That seems kind of weird, though. Um, I don't know. I want it over here for right now. Let's put it over here. There, performing stage. I don't know how you get a musician. Let's check our mail real quick. Oh, jeez. Uh, with your tavern for inspection. Uh, yeah, sure. Come and inspect it. Whatever. What's the worst that could happen? Uh, over here, group for eight. Yep. Bring your group, please, if you would. Uh, res reservations for five? <laughs> Is there a way to slow the game down? Monthly income, 600. Okay, we're slowly starting to go up. We're at 13,000 gold, though. Um, yeah, we'll be fine. Okay, we're gonna need... Wow. Okay, we're gonna need more tables. Uh, we're gonna need more tables and probably more bars. Uh, more tables. I want two at the very least. Where can I put this? Let's see. Go ahead and put this table. I probably should have packed the tables closer together. 
We'll put one over there. Can I put a table over here? Uh, no, that's in the way. All right. We'll start putting tables around this way, though. Ooh. Ooh, I can't because of where the bar is. Um, okay. I'll put a table over here, then. We could put a table right there. Nope. Wow. Okay. Yep. Peep. Oh, boy. It is a giant. Man, we are hopping today. Crap. I had no idea. Um, oh, the males are coming left and right. Uh, yep, come on, bring it on, bring it on, nine people, sure, keep them coming, we need more bar tops, people, oh, we need more bar tops, another bar top, right, oh, I can't put it there, I can't put it there because there's a freaking table there, um, okay, hold on, can I get rid of something after I place it, policy, research, what are policies, maiden, 70%, Leave their current post and move to the staff room. All right, that's not too bad. A guest room's 100 gold. Study. Uh, free of charge. A gym. We don't have a gym yet. Apply for a loan. Oh, man, I don't want a loan. 30 gold for food, 10 gold for liquor. Let's keep that as it is right now. Um, so one of the things I'm noticing is I don't know if there's a way to get rid of stuff. Uh, reposition. Hold on. Here we go. Yes. Yes! Okay, how do you reposition something? Ah, look at this! Oh, okay, got it. All right, let's do some repositioning. We're gonna be doing big repositioning here. Hold on, boys. Sorry for standing you up from your seat. You're going right there for right now. We gotta, we gotta freaking move all this stuff in. Oh, you guys are gonna be so pissed off with me. Everyone's gonna be so pissed off. Everyone's like, where'd my freaking table go? What happened? Yes, clump those tables together. Clump them together, baby. That's what time it is. All right, another table right over there. Now we're starting to get tables. Now we're starting to... I think we're starting to make some money, too. Oh, I think this is the first time I've seen our money go in the green. Uh, yep, another table right over there. That looks fantastic. Okay, we need to get another bar table somehow. Um, what is in the way? I think it was this, this table over here, but now we've moved it. So we should be able to get another bar top. Because, man, these guys love bars. Yes. Nice. Okay, good. More staff. Uh, another bartender. Who's our best? C's. C's all around. B. Butchamp. M. Porter. Rampson. Bennett. Butchamp. This sounds amazing. I'll have you know I pour drinks only at the most prestigious of events. My experience is unmatched. And my knowledge is deep as barrels themselves. You will not regret hiring me as I believe myself to be an authority on the matter of alcohol. Well, sir, you're hired. Now get up there and start making people not remember what freaking time it is. Oh, boy. We may need another bathroom. I think it's October now. Staff wage was 776. Okay, what do we got for mail? Any group reservations? Yep, we sure do. Seven people? We can handle seven people. No big deal. Uh, what do we got here? Lord Peter. Yep, Lord Peter, come on in. Keep it up. What do we got? Definitely one of the best I've seen. I'm proud to have you running the tavern. You've been awarded 1,500 gold and 20 additional reputation. Well, thank you, Lord Peter. Another group res reservation. Seven more people. Yes. I love it. We're hopping. We're hopping big time. I want to know, though. I don't think that we can hire a musician right now. So I think that this is kind of a, um, oh, research. What can I research? Sausage and eggs? Garden salad? Oh, I see. Right now, all we're serving is sausage and eggs along with a garden salad. And if we put it this way, we're all about learning a new recipe. But if we put it this way, we're all about approving what we have. And if we go like this, it's kind of 50-50. Let's go new recipe all the way. I kind of want to see what happens here. Wow! Look at the freaking bar! Holy jeez! Oh, they're getting vomiting all over the place. No. <laughs> okay, we need another handyman. T-Day, you're hired. New handyman. Get up in there, please. I need you. I, I need you big time. It's November now. Okay, I know the staff wage is going up big time. Requesting a raise. Who is it? E. Tabard. She wants 75. 115. Uh, yeah, I'm going to give her a raise. 
More staff reservations. Yep, bring them on. We we've got the best sausage and eggs in town, baby. We're the we're the number one when it comes to this stuff. This guy's kind of just taking a little snooze over here. What else can we do for zones? So like if I do a rest zone, let's see here. So we already have this as a rest zone, right? So like am I allowed to put another item here, I wonder? Oh, you can put several toilet booths in. Yes. This is what I wanted to know. Okay, good. Let's put a whole bunch of toilet booths in. We do not have male and female bathrooms right now. Um, I'm going to put five toilet booths in. Excellent. Okay, now I understand. And we're also going to put a nice wash basin in. Going to put... Can we put more than one down? Uh, no, that looks like all we can do. Okay, good. Now we have several bathrooms that people can use. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. So I kind of wonder then, could you put more than one bed down? There we go. I went ahead and redid the uh, quarters for our, uh, our staff over here. Now there's several couches so that more than one person can go to sleep. And man, there's all kinds of stuff still happening over here. Look at this. What is this? Uh, keep it up. Poor results. Poor results. After inspecting your tavern, I'm deeply frustrated. Please improve it. Oh, no. Well, folks, I've got bad news. Gray's lustrous hall of lordly feasts and merrymaking is no longer in business. Sadly, I've been staring at this little pony for quite a while. I saved the game and then tried to load it just to see what would happen. And I haven't been able to load back into my game. <laughs> so... I'm not sure why that is. I had another save file and that one seemed to work, but I made a new one and that one does not seem to work anymore. So for right now, our tavern is uh, offline and suspended. I can always build up from where I was last time. I think that this is just like, I don't know if this is an issue on my end or an issue, just a bug in the game or something like that. There's a lot of potential in this game though. I actually really liked the hustle of running the tavern. Like that was real. The struggle was real for the tavern. I do appreciate that. It makes me feel like I owned a legitimate tavern business and my blood pressure was about to explode and my heart was going to fail. So that is the appropriate feeling to attain for someone who goes into the food industry. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed this episode of Tavern Tycoon. It is a neat little game. I want to look into some of the other stuff, though like the spas and the gyms and things like that. That could be really neat, especially if you can just get like different types of patrons in and have different streams of revenue and the recipes and like research and stuff like that could open up a lot of different things as well. Anyway, feel free to let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Until the next time, folks, stay foxy and much love.